we keep bringing you updates from the world of robotics. Watch this story to see how robots are becoming smarter and more sophisticated. Look at this. It's not an ordinary dog. What you see is a robot guide dog. Developed by a Chinese university, the robot dog can identify obstacles and choose routes. That's not all. The quadruped robot can also climb stairs and respond to human voice commands within a second. Moreover, unlike real guide dogs which are inherently colorblind, the robot dog can see colors, which means it can identify and follow traffic lights. The robot dog can accurately take people to their destinations in complex environments such as airport terminals. The robot has reached acceptable levels in terms of stability, noise and intelligence. Shanghai Disabled Persons Federation said it could be put into trial use in November this year. It's believed that this robot can help visually impaired people go out safely. According to reports, there are over 17 million visually impaired people in China. Researchers hope such robots could come in handy. Researchers at Cambridge University have unveiled a new controllable extra thumb to enhance productivity. It can carry multiple beverage glasses, shuffle playing cards and can even perform surgery with razor-sharp precision. This extra thumb could expand what is biologically possible with the capacity of the human hand. The robotic body arm is worn on the opposite side of the palm to the biological thumb. It is controlled by a pressure sensor placed under both toes. While pressure from the right toe pulls the third thumb across the hand, the pressure exerted with the left toe pulls the thumb up toward the fingers. Researchers are optimistic about the possible applications of the third thumb. We are also really excited about potential opportunities of using the thumb to enhance productivity in work settings, specifically for people that are relying on their hands' manual dexterity in order to accomplish their work. And this can be anywhere between manual laborers that are trying to solder a complicated um, gear kit or even surgeons uh, that have to negotiate between many instruments at the same time. Meanwhile, the third thumb could also offer support to those with accessibility needs. Even though the thumb is designed for able-bodied people, we can easily envisage situations where people with disabilities could enjoy or benefit from the extra help of the thumb. So we're trying to build the thumb as an alternative to traditional assistive technologies. Researchers hope that with further testing, the third thumb could help design a new relationship with technology and redefine human capabilities. The next time you pull up your vehicle at a gas station in UAE, don't be surprised if you find a robot filling up your car's fuel tank. Abu Dhabi National Oil Company has launched a robotic fueling arm pilot. With the help of sensors and cameras, the robotic arm extends toward the vehicle, opens the fuel tank cap and aligns the nozzle to fill the car up. It is designed to be fast and environmentally friendly as it manages spills. First robotic fueling arm in the region, powered by AI and computer vision. Basically, the customer has to, to register an ad -nook distribution to use our robotic arm. He has to drive his car all the way to here. And based on preset data in our application, the arm will recognize the car and will fill based on his request. This technology is set to be used in support of existing staff to boost productivity and reduce wait times. Look at this automatic patrol robot. It has been put into operation in China's Hangzhou. The robot can snap photos of its surroundings which are then sent to the background system in real time. In case of an incident, the robot will transmit a signal allowing law enforcement officials in the vicinity to respond promptly. The entire reporting procedure typically takes less than five minutes.